Hi, you're watching the second episode of Career Level Up Stories, and today we're thrilled to have with us our learner from Mahe, Adarsh Srivatsa. Adarsh has been placed at EY as a data engineer with the assistance from our placements team. So, hi, Adarsh. How are you doing today? Hello, Lalita. Uh, thanks for inviting me here. Uh, I'm doing great. How about you? Thank you. I'm doing very well as well. Uh, so, you know, first things first. Let's start with your introduction. Tell us a little bit about yourself, your background, and everything. Yeah, uh, basically, I'm from Mysore. Uh, like, uh, I hold the degree of Bachelor of Engineering from BD University. Uh, initially, my career journey started with an internship with the uh, ADU Softwares, uh, followed by developer at Technotry. Uh, when I was uh, working in Technotry, uh, I was looking for the opportunity to skill up myself mm -hmm. with the data science. So that's where I got the opportunity with the uh, Mahe. Uh, then. Uh, when it is final semester, I wanted to switch the career to data science and also wanted to focus on my project. So that's the reason I resigned. And uh, as you can see, like uh, today I am pursuing or started the career at uh, EY as mm -hmm. a data engineer. All right, that's, that's wonderful to hear. So uh, I just wanted to know why you went ahead with an online degree and not the other way around like a conventional one. Uh, well, the reason behind is like uh, I just wa don't wanted to like uh, break my career uh, in between, and so I just wanted an interface in between. Uh, I also wanted to uh, pursue the degree and also wanted to work as well at the panel. So that's the reason I didn't uh, choose to break in. Between. Great. Could you share a little bit about the curriculum and how it directly applies to your work at EY? Well, I would like to say that uh, uh, we'll bring up with the semesters, okay? Uh, the first sem will definitely uh, focus on your core skills about the data science. And the second and third semester were uh, focused on the different roles in the data science. And uh, fourth semester, it will definitely answer the uh, role which you are interested in, like uh, specifically towards data engineer or data scientist, that mm -hmm. will be answered. So in overall, I would like to say that that MSc data science degree is very much focused on uh, data science. Oh, that's very inspiring to know, actually. And uh, would you say those skills that you've gained through uh, your curriculum have helped you get a job at EY? Yes, definitely. Uh, like, as I mentioned before, uh, the programming language like mm -hmm. Python, uh, SQL, R, and along with it, they will bring up uh, the tech called Apache Spark. Uh, that will definitely play a big role in the big data domain. Uh, recent, very recently, that uh, has overridden the uh, MapReduce tech behind. Okay. So uh, Mahi uh, has definitely helped me to understand the Apache Spark mm -hmm. and uh, the PySpark, which implements the same. So that uh, those kind of things, it helped me to land up the job in the uh, EY. Great. So let's move on to placements uh, now. Uh, so let us know about you know how your experience with the placements uh, team was. Yeah, it was very good. Like uh, I would like to say that uh, placement department scheduled a uh, few sessions related to resume and interview preparations. Mm -hmm. Those sessions helped us a lot to crack the interview. And how was the coordination from the placements team? They were very well coordinating. Like uh, if at all I need a conversation with the placement department, I would be reaching out to the mentor. Mm -hmm. They would be arranging a call as per the need. Yeah, that was really good. Okay, great. And how important was it for you to get this job? Yeah, it was very important. Uh, I would like to say that uh, the curiosity will drive me in. Uh, the latest technology we are seeing like AI, data science, so that's the reason I wanted to switch to data science mm -hmm. and explore more. Uh, so if it wasn't been happen, so I would definitely be disappointed. But luckily with Manipal, it won't happen like that. Okay. They will develop it and make sure you get in whatever it, the goal you have. Uh, so lastly, how do you feel about the decision to join the online degree program uh, with online Manipal? Um, do you have any highlights to mention? Yeah, I'm very happy. Uh, the initially, it started with a complete virtual. Mm -hmm. uh, we uh, started getting know each other by virtually, like we made some groups in WhatsApp as well. Uh, we connected through LinkedIn. 
uh, we were having the conversation like with the peers or uh, candidates who are there in that uh, particular degree uh, then came the like a final year that is uh, after third sem we were having one event called panorama uh, there we had the opportunity to talk with uh, like in person with the other candidates or the students yeah. and also we had the opportunity to, to speak with the faculty mm-hmm. and uh, that was a great opportunity to be with all right adarsh yeah. thank you so much for being here thank you for taking the time out to have a conversation with us yeah. this talk was quite insightful i hope it helps or inspires other students to also pursue their educational dreams yeah it would be very much inspiring for others as well uh, i would like to bring in something like uh, the more it would be helpful for early professionals or professionals as well to upskill themselves the mahi online manipal will be an answer for that Thank you so much for the advice and for being here. So, stay tuned for more such inspiring content on the next episode of Career Level Up Stories.